do recall while in India, I created a statue dance of my own called the Cosmic Dance of Shiva. It turned out to be one of the most popular pieces I have ever performed. The immortal Anna Pavlova, on her visits to India, rekindled the flame of Indian dancing. Fifty years ago, urban India was ignorant of its precious heritage of ancient temple dances. When Pavlova asked to be shown them, she was told they had been dead for centuries. So she studied frescoes and statues, and used her genius to resuscitate Indian dancing as a high art. Some years later, the story of her life kindled in Ram both his love of Western ballet and his desire to restore his native dances to their proper place in India and the West. As an Indian dancer, I feel the need to practice at the Russian bar every day. These sessions with Maria Fay improve and strengthen my line, power and endurance. By now, Ram had mastered the two most important forms of temple dancing, the Kathakali and the Bharatanatya, and had added his own creations to his repertoire, notably the dance of Garuda, the golden eagle, and his dance of the setting sun. His early performances were for the simple village folk in their remote temples scattered over Mysore. He soon gained the patronage of the Yuva Raja of Mysore, who invited him to dance at a large gathering. This was such a success that invitations came from every part of India, which in turn led to a meeting with the American ethnic dancer, Lamnerie, who urged his parents to let him tour India and the Far East with her. The East loudly applauded his fire and genius, then America, Poland, Paris, and London, and he was not yet 20 years old. Ram then returned to India to form his Hindu ballet. He took his new company around India and then to the West again. In the 20s, Europe had seen the pioneer Uday Shankar with Anna Pavlova, but never the traditional temple dances that Ram Gopal presented. Ram has said, I always dance in order to enter that other world. An impulse, a fire, a tremendous force seizes me. golden eagle flies ceaselessly in the skies, swooping to kill with his avenging talons the serpents of evil that crawl on the earth.
la 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 Thank you. 